Hi guys, my name's Chris. What I'm going to do today is show you how to set up a program called GSC. Now what this program is, is it's kind of like X-Fire and links with Game Tracker. A lot of people like to use it for their voice servers. So what I'm showing you today is how to set this up and then log on to a voice server. So the first thing you're going to have to do is download GSC. So you're going to go to Google and Google Get GSC to bring their home page up right here. Once you have this, downloads, pick which one you have, 32-bit or 64-bit. Oh, 64-bit's coming soon, regardless. You press the download now and you download GSC. Once you have it all downloaded, you need to create an account. So you fire up GSC. You get this. If you need an account, click Need an Account. You fill out all this information. This is anything starred, is something you need, but I already have an account, so I'm just going to show this to you real quick. You click create account and you're good to go. Once you have your account created, you can log in. And this takes a minute. But like I said, it's linked with game tracker so you can if you play any of the games that are on game tracker it'll link you up with that and you can you know do all your stats and everything else through game tracker and GSC now once you have logged on to GSC you need to find yourself a voice server now, the way to do that is if you know where you're going you go to voice click add down here by searching. Now I'm going to use my Combat Arm Clan's voice server as a reference. So I would type in Midnight Ravens, click search. I will bring this up here. Now you can you can add it to your public voice servers, which is over here, or you can just join. If I click join, it's going to bring up this screen here. Hey, look, here I am. Okay, once you're here, you need to be able to talk with your clan mates. So we're going to go to audio, audio settings. Now, first and foremost, everybody hates it when somebody has a voice activated uh, voice connection, meaning every time you speak, the mic will fire up. So we're going to click push to talk. Now, once you click that, you're going to click change, and that's what it's saying right here is it's waiting for me to press a button, and that'll be my push to talk button. I use my mouse four. Now, this is uh, your input, output, and you can audio preview. Now, let's see here, let's go to account. And you can change, you know, basic account information, nickname, and your phonetics. That's my phonetic for when I log on. Let's go to user interface. You can change your skin on here. Just pretty nifty. I'm using Centrifuge. Friends and chat. Pretty self-explanatory. Voice servers. This just says right here. If I click add a voice server, I can automatically log on to this every time GSC is fired up. Uh, notifications. Here's a spiffy little page. What I can do is on any of these conditions here, I can have it play a sound, play text to speech, or do nothing. Now, mine is when I start talking, I usually use Ventrilo. And if you've ever used Ventrilo, when you press down your push to talk key, it makes a noise. So I have it play a sound. Now you can browse your sounds and then test it here. That's the sound it makes when I push down my push to talk key. You don't need to worry about if you find in your options codecs and all that stuff. It's all set by the server. Here's just nifty little op options. You can do file transfers through GSC. You can record all your game servers. You can even do stuff in game if the game supports it. And here you can set up each one of your games for certain options. For example, Combat Arms is what I play a lot. So if I launch it right here from GSC, I can launch Combat Arms straight from here. 
and these are all the options for that. Now once you've logged in and you've got your push to talk set up, it's pretty self-explanatory. You're done. You can now start talking with your friends on GSC. Now if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, you can always leave me a comment on my YouTube channel or find me here in the Midnight Ravens. There's no password on the server, so you can just hop on in and ask me something. Uh, thanks for your time.